Hello, we're fixing everything, and because there is always something to be fixed, today we're gonna fix these tires. Subscribe to the video, I hope you find it helpful. Give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment if uh, your repair was also successful. This pair of tires cost me around 25 euros, and uh, it's looking awful as you can see. I got a lot of rust and uh, it's not looking uh, really pleasant so because you're looking at your car every time maybe you want uh, your tires to look a bit better and I'll show you how quickly main thing is quickly and easily to accomplish this result which uh, is looking really nice it's not like a brand new wheel but it definitely looks a lot better so first I'm not gonna dismount the tires from the wheels but the same thing goes for bare rims as well so if you have bare rims without valves and weights on them even better if you have a tire with the welds already balanced this method will also work for you what you can do which I'm not gonna do is remove the weights just make a mark where the weight is with a plier and then hammer it back on I'm not gonna do that I'll just leave it as it is and I'll just paint on top because these tires are not going to be removed from the rims for the next 3-4 years. Uh, something else, you need a, a few tools, I'll show you everything you're going to need in a second and I'll show you what you need to do to uh, get to the result on the right. First you're going to need something uh, to take the rest off with. I'm using just a drill you can watch my other video i'm running the drill for battery but it doesn't matter just something with wire brush can be a belt grinder like a angle grinder with a wire attach attachment you can do it by hand if you want but just is gonna take a lot longer uh, i got these two i'm using these two you'll see in a second then you're gonna need a degreaser for uh taking the rust off you're gonna need a compressed air or something to remove the rust that uh, accumulates off the wheel after that you're gonna need a primer uh, for a good bond between the paint and the wheel and you're gonna need a wheel paint or you can use any paint really because the tires don't get too hot on normal cars if you're gonna do racing you just need something a bit stronger this was the cheapest one that's why i chose it and this is a tire glance for a tire just to make it shiny um, on the outside to look good for the thumbnail that's it let's start working i'm on the camera i got the tires one on top of the, of the other what i'm gonna do first i'll take all of the service rust out i'll speed up the video minutes later the tire is uh, with removed rust now let's uh, let's blow the let's blow, blow the rust out okay so I'll need a bit more air in the in the compressor let's blow the rust out
Okay, next step now. We need to tape up the valve. Oh. We need to tape the valve with some uh, paper tape. Because it's very sticky, I'll just uh, tape it to my trouser. So, just put in. Now you can see here, it's not very well cleaned from the rust, but this is because we don't remove the tire. If you remove the tire, uh, it's a lot better for the tire, for the valve stem because the paint reacts with it and it's not really good but it will be fine for, for this set of tires okay so the valve stem is all taped up now you're gonna need some cards did I put the cards in the beginning? I don't think so um, let's just bring the cards in here, I'll just put my gloves back so depending on where you're spraying you might need to tape a little bit of uh, plastic tape a bit tricky on a few places but don't worry too much just put a few more cards in and it's gonna be fine Now after all this is done, I will spray the primer, I will clean it up, oh, we should have cleaned it up before we, ah, oh my, let's clean it up now. Put the cards after we clean it up. Now the greaser. You don't need a whole lot of the greaser.
well now you know why. I prefer to use the back parts of the cards so I can see if I'm spraying extra. More carbonate. Clean as thoroughly as possible. Now, I think we're ready. To uh, give it a paint, let's put it to one side. Shake the primer. Let's give it a go. Now, I'll just prepare the other two tires and while we're waiting, the primer will dry up. We'll put a coat of paint. So, after it is dry now, dry, I shake the, the wheel paint. So, uh, let's just give it a go. Make sure you paint all the edges. It's good if you can change the nozzle with a flat one. Uh, so it's easier to paint. Unfortunately, we don't have one, so we paint them with a pointy one. Okay, now we're gonna wait for uh, five to ten minutes, and we'll do a second coat. Okay, so ten minutes later, or maybe five. Uh, it's dry, it's relatively dry, so let's uh, spur another coat. Don't go too much because you can see here it's uh, leaking. It's leaking because of the uh, thick coat of the uh, paint.
So that's it. Now we'll wait for it to dry up and we'll remove all the cards, we'll remove the tape and I'll just give it the final wax. While we wait, you can make yourself a cup of tea in the rabbit uh, cup. I removed the cards already, but the valve uh, paper, it's a bit hard, so just take a pair of pliers, of uh, tweezers, and And give it a twist. Just don't forget to take it out. Because if you don't take it out, oh, I scratched it. <laughs> okay. Never mind. Don't worry. Now, because this is the video, it's gonna be awful. Okay, and now take a sponge, take a tire shine, silicone one, and let's put a little bit on the tire, first on the edge. Now we're gonna go and we're gonna compare to the tire I showed you earlier. But I think the result is pretty nice. There we go. That's it. Let's go and put it next to the other one. There we go, this is the final result. It looks pretty nice. Do you think it looks nice? Yeah? Uh, that's it, that's how to repair uh, and uh, make your tires and wheels look nice. I hope the video has been helpful to you. Like and subscribe, give me a comment. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye.